over roses for the house. Gotta have jalapenos. Two, this is gonna be the simplest gazpacho recipe you have ever tried in your life. And I think if I can remember right, it came from this little restaurant in Madrid where we took my dad on his, I think it was his 85th birthday back to his home country. He hadn't been there since he was 19 years old. They loved him. He spoke the Castilian Spanish and they treated him like gold. And this is the little, um, I guess the little vase or pitcher that we got from the restaurant. They hand make them in the restaurant. And uh, it's been uh, something that I have brought back as a great, great memory from that trip. So let's get started. This is how easy this recipe is. I'm just gonna use about four pounds of tomatoes, one cucumber, a half of a red onion, orange pepper, bell pepper. You can use a yellow. I just like the color better and green. And I'm going to throw this banana pepper in there just because Jim's brother grew it in his garden. I'm going to put in two jalapenos. You can omit, omit those if you want to, but they add just a little bit of spice. Three cloves of garlic, a fourth a cup of olive oil, and then three tablespoons of some kind of a white wine vinegar. You can use a champagne vinegar, salt and pepper. And then all I'm going to do is just throw this into the blender. Let the blender do all the heavy lifting for me and it's going to be delicious. taste. 